Hi friends, uh, we are the final year student from Valtech University. Uh, we have our final project on uh, hybrid power generation in highways. Uh, we are using a renewable source of energy uh, which is pollution free and uh, friendly you can use it. Uh, here is our here is our uh, uh, wind turbine with the uh, circuit connected and a solar panel hybrid uh, source uh, we are taking a wind energy and a solar panel uh, wind energy is known as the cleanest energy of sources and solar panel uh, to capture the sunlight from the sun uh, this is a wind setup uh, where uh, uh, in generally a, uh, a windmills uses only one turbine to rotate but in our project we are using two turbine which are connected uh, at uh, both end of the shaft will, will, uh, which will generate equal power this uh, windmills is set up in highways where the vehicles moves in high speed and uh, it will produce high pressures in the in this blade which will rotate at high speeds uh, the vehicles may be like lorries heavy trucks buses which will rotate in very high speed in mainly national highways which can produce enough energy to produce electricity since our project is based on hybrid uh, power generation uh, uh, according uh, with wind energy, we are using a solar panel which, which will capture the sunlight from the sun and it can be placed either in uh, either in sideways to wind turbine. In, initially, we need external supply uh, to operate the circuit. This is the uh, external supply we are taking from a plug uh, which will operate uh, this circuit. This is the wind source. The, where the wind source will uh, produce a AC, AC voltage, high AC voltage. In order to uh, low it, we are uh, uh, taking two step down transformer. The uh, high AC voltage which are coming from the wind turbines uh, uh, will be converted to low, low AC voltage from step down transformer. In coming forward, the, the, there are two power rectifier will, will which will convert the uh, ac into uh, ac to dc then it it is embedded in, in this circuit this hybrid uh, hybrid circuit the, uh, these are the uh, these are the circuits inputs the, uh, the two solar uh, two wind turbines which are connected here and one solar which are also fitted here and these are the two sensor uh, one is uh, one is uh, temperature sensor and another is light sensor for sensing the light this is hybrid circuit and the last row is uh, power supply unit these three are voltage regulator uh, this these two are 7 8 series and this is 7 9 series this is plus 5 volt this is pl plus 12 this is minus 12 these three are capacitors and uh, small small are paper capacitor this is potentiometer which uh, uh, regulate the voltage with respect to batteries for charging this is mosfet which will uh, which will protect the battery from overcharging and it will protect it these four diodes are polarity controller this is for storing the charges instead of battery we are using ultra capacitor which will be have which will have more life span than battery and it store charges with high with higher capacity than battery uh, since uh, since uh, we are using a hybrid system with solar energy and wind energy uh, these two sources are not continuous uh, 
sometimes uh, it uh, it won't pr produce energy on that time uh, the current stores in us uh, in this circuit we will uh, will go to the reverse uh, reverse point in order to protect the damage to the wind wind or solar when we are keeping the diode in reverse reverse so that it will protect the uh, current from overflowing to, to reverse direction and uh, it will store in a battery itself this is embedded circuit which consists of four electromagnetic switches as relays this is uh, IC relay driver this is microcontroller with PIC 16F877A uh, here the program is stored and this is uh, this uh, is crystal oscillator which is uh, t temperature uh, independent it maintains the temperature to certain limit this is re reset switch and this is uh, RS232 which is uh, embedded to the uh, system which is system is went here to here Uh, when the vehicles are moving in highways with higher speeds the uh, high uh, high pressure wind will strike to this blade which will rotate in speeds high speeds and it will generate power on generating on generating power we can see these two leds which are glowing uh, from this we can know that the uh, the voltage has voltage has came to this uh, rectifier unit and here in hybrid circuit these three LEDs which shows the wind wind energies are produced which will be stored in this ultra capacitors this is uh, here uh, for storing charges instead of battery we are using ultra capacitor which will hold uh, the stores for a longer time and which will give um, uh, more lifespan <coughs> than battery this is solar panel which will capture the sunlight from the sun solar will convert the sunlight to electric current uh, through photovoltaic effect uh, th these LEDs are showing the uh, sunlight which is striking on the su uh, sunlight is which is striking at the solar panel and uh, this uh, the, this other lights you can see here uh, the wind turbines wind turbines is rotating this is microsoft visual basics where you can see the solar panel which captures the sunlight from the sun and a wind turbine which rotate the wind from running vehicles in highway uh, these are the two uh, wind turbines wind one uh, we are getting a uh, ac voltage wind two we are getting ac voltage but uh, from the so solar panel we are getting a dc voltage here is a hybrid volt uh, uh, both we are uh, we are converting to both converting to dc voltage which is showing the output this is the current sensor and this is the light sensor these are the two graphs of both solar and wind with uh, with uh, certain outputs certain outputs this is glowing this is uh, with rotation of wind turbine 